Nestled in the green hills of Ireland, in a town named Leakslip, is one of Europe's most technologically advanced manufacturing operations. It's home to Intel Ireland. For more than 30 years, the site has produced billions of Intel computer chips. Ireland's newest factory to come online, Fab 34, is producing chips on the company's most advanced process technology in high volume, called Intel 4. The opportunity that our organization has to, to, to be front and center and to put our stamp on the, the future of Intel, the future success of IDM 2.0, it's, it's an incredibly exciting time. Intel 4 is Intel's first technology node to use EUV, or extreme ultraviolet, lithography machines. Already in production in Oregon, these school bus size machines weigh almost 200 tons. They advance Moore's law by using radically shorter wavelengths of light, enabling the creation of smaller transistors and components etched on computer chips. It's probably the most complex machine mankind has produced. Uh, it's, it's also pushing the boundaries of science in terms of how it, how it operates. Uh, and, and that enables us to, to you know, look at the future technologies that we want to introduce on the site, like Intel 3. Intel Ireland is key in helping achieve CEO Pat Gelsinger's goal of an unprecedented five manufacturing process nodes in four years. Making these advanced chips internally is one pillar of Intel's IDM 2.0 strategy. The second is using chips made at other foundries when needed. And the third pillar is establishing a world-class foundry with Intel Foundry Services. Intel Ireland is making chips for both internal and foundry customers. So it is absolutely a critical time for Intel Ireland and it is really the start of positioning us to be an IDM 2.0 on both fabs, both in a legacy technology and a future node. Fab 24 leaders know how important the foundry is to Intel and they know they are improving Intel's foundry model and world-class customer service. The Foundry customer is betting their entire business every time they give you a product for Foundry. They're betting on your ability to execute, and that does drive a different mindset. The teams at Fabs 34 and 24 will share their skills at creating Intel's latest advanced technologies with teams at existing Intel Fabs in Israel, the U.S., and new factories planned in Arizona, Ohio, and Magdeburg, Germany. All these efforts are in support of Intel's goal to balance the world's semiconductor global supply chain. The accumulation of these projects will fundamentally change the shape of the semiconductor industry in Europe, I believe, over the course of the next five to ten years. And that's, that's, we should expect no less than that. Intel Ireland's almost 5,000 employees are up for the challenge. I suppose I've been working here almost ten years now and I've never had two days the same. Um, it's never boring, <laughs> we'll put it that way. Um, it's incredibly complex and difficult work, but the people you're working with are the absolute best at what they do. Intel Ireland has an incredible um, path ahead and has an incredible place in what Intel is doing worldwide. Um, and so it's incredibly humbling and exciting to be, to be part of that. Mm -hmm.